Hello YouTube. I'm here showing you my birds of paradise. This is one of four plants that I have in my property. Like you see, it's a fully grown plant. Um, this one is the best one because it, it gets light pretty much all day long. So it has more um, birds paradise. Uh, so like you see, it's, it's a really beautiful birds of paradise plant. Here is a one close fully grown. And I've been kind of just trimming it, taking out the the bad uh, plants and uh, leaves and so forth. Um, here is my second one. It's a little bit smaller. Like I was saying, uh, these don't get a lot of sun, so there's not a, there's not a lot of um, birds growing from them. This, I don't know what it is, but it's a great plant because it doesn't need no water whatsoever. Uh, it, it just lives without any water. Here is my second one. Uh, again, it has less, less birds of paradise because it gets only like about half a day or maybe less of sun because where it's at here's my other one and again this is a, another one that also gets less sun uh, I also have this tree in my property I'm not sure what type of tree it is but it's sad to say but I'm taking everything out I'm gonna pot some of the birds of paradise to put them in later but uh, my plan is to put grass and then from there start all over again this is one of them that um this one here has a lot of birds of paradise because it gets sun pretty much all day long uh beautiful um uh, feel bad taking it down but i'm gonna re do uh redo my landscaping and uh, i think this is probably the best step to kind of just take everything out and put grass first and then put it out uh, repot um all of them again the way i want them because they kind of grow too big and feel like it's out of control right now so i want to make sure i get back control to fit my landscaping needs um again here's the tree it grows some type of a white flower and i think people eat that but i'm not sure what that is if anyone knows let me know be nice to know all right youtube this is it birds of paradise all right bye